But yeah, inauguration day yesterday. Yeah, uh, historic. Man, oh man. Did you, I did you did you watch the whole thing live? Or? I watched uh, most of it. I saw the beginning part. I didn't see any of the concerts afterwards. You know, mm -hmm. I didn't. I just saw the the main thing, the the swearing in, yeah. Lady Gaga, J Lo, the poem by the uh, the young lady. I can't remember her name right now, and I'm an asshole for that because uh, she was the star. She she read a beautiful poem. Yeah, and um, I'm such a jerk. I don't even remember her name. <laughs> I can bring it for you real quick. Nah, don't worry about it. People in the people know, you know, it doesn't matter. It was yeah, a beautiful right. poem. Um, my thoughts in the inauguration was I, I couldn't believe how like pleased I was and just happy, you know? Like, like relieved. A, just relieved, like yeah. a huge orange weight <laughs> <laughs> just <laughs> lifted off my shoulders, you know. It's just Whew. Yeah, I feel yeah. you, man. I felt that same way. Um, yeah, uh, I, I just, was, uh, the the uh, the hope that is there. Not to sound all cheesy, but I haven't really felt. I don't know. I felt like that whenever Obama got elected. You know, I mean, that was their kind of campaign thing that they were pushing. But yeah, um, it was like this is obviously a change. You know, one way or another, however you want to look at it, things <laughs> right, are changing, right. right? Like it's pretty massive, right? And uh, I don't know. I, uh, this is the second time I've felt like that, where okay, I mean, like just right away, he's getting on things that day, and you know, it yes. seems like he's got his mind in the right place and he's making some changes. There was a, I was reading, uh, I'm going to draw a blank on what they're called now, but you know, he's like signing off these presidential orders, like reversing some of the things that. Trump right. did. And um, I mean, just some things that are just not uh, didn't seem morally right. You know, like he he signed some things where he's going to put the families back together that were split up at the border, mm -hmm. like we're halting the border wall. And the border wall thing is like. Have you ever been? Like, have, have you has anyone ever been to Texas? Have you driven through the desert? Do you understand how right. fucking long that border is yeah. like? You're, you're talking about this much wall was built right. and, and shitloads of money wasted. So I don't know. Um, yeah, there, there's a couple of things like uh, the Muslim ban. He reversed that ban, not banned, but ban, you know. Right. No, no. Yeah. And yeah, we got we got adults running the government now. You yeah, know, it's, it's not a, a half ass, you know. Uh, con job basically is is mm -hmm. how I would you know refer to the last administration the the orange administration is what I'd like to call it right. um, but the yeah just the, the tremendous relief like now I know what like um, I mean not you know exactly but like you know they say that if you're in an abused relationship or PTSD mm -hmm. you know, it's just like when it's finally over it probably felt like that. Like I felt yesterday, just, uh, you know, yeah. take a deep breath and, um, you know, now we can move on, you know, hopefully, you know, yeah. God willing. So, yeah, with that analogy, it's like you don't realize how bad things get until you're out of that situation. As far as relationships, you know, it is kind of the same thing where you have a second to step back and go like, man, it just kind of slowly piled on and piled on and piled on. Right. It was just, it was a constant barrage of, of tweets, uh, negativity mm -hmm. and just, um, yeah, just, I don't, I don't, you know, I, I, you know, I don't think this country, you know, it didn't, it didn't fit us well, even though, you know, this is America and, you know, we do whatever we want or say whatever we want, but yeah, just the uh, back and forth, back and forth. even my Twitter feed is just calming down now with the back, you know, it's just, <laughs> yeah. you know, red, blue, everywhere. but what about this? But what about that? But what about this? You know, all that shit hopefully can go away and we can come together. And mm -hmm. I, I think that was probably the, the, the biggest, you know, the right man at the right time, you know, everything they say about Biden and even his um, inauguration speech was just, I mean, how can, even if you're on the, the other side, how can you be upset at a guy who says he wants to bring the country together? Right. Like, how can he be a dick? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's like. Yeah. And if he's completely full of shit, you know, it might take a little while to find out, but 
I mean, how could you not have, th that's the hope I was talking about, you know, like, okay, this feels like us, we're steering the ship in the right direction now. Right. Everything's going to yeah. get back to normal, you know, as far as, um, mm -hmm. you know, the presidency and the uh, government and governance, as yeah. they say, you know, yeah. hopefully. And hopefully.